We are here with uh, Principal Carls and Johnson, and this is a great opportunity for us to, to come out and enjoy Hoops for a Cure. I want to thank you, Principal, for allowing us to come to your gym to play this awesome team that you have this year again, and uh, just really make awareness for breast cancer. Thank you, Mayor Fisher. You've done such a fantastic job in, in Pompano Beach, and Blanche really loved to host this event. Uh, we won it last year, Mayor, but we expect to have a good game. You look like you've got a, little, a lot of talent here, but we want to pray for this cure because this is an epidemic that has a, a impacted our entire nation, and we're going to keep this going, Mayor Fisher, and thank you. Absolutely. We've got to keep you off the court. Absolutely. Absolutely. But you're the man. <laughs> you know, this event is what we call Hoops for a Cure, and what it really focuses on is breast cancer awareness. And uh, thanks to our human resource department, our risk management department, along with Eddie Beecher, he's really masterminded this. And this is our second annual opportunity to come out, make awareness of breast cancer, be able to play at Blanche Lee High School. Their gymnasium and their team is really a cool thing, really bringing awareness to breast cancer. We also have our public works uh, players out here. We have our, our public works. We have our utility guys out here. We have parks and recreation guys out here. And it really just comes up and has a fun, hope you raise a few dollars at the same time. Eddie Beecher, again, he's to be complimented on making this a reality. Well, first of all, thank you, Mayor, for coming out and supporting, uh, supporting the program. This started out as a wellness event for our city employees. And they would get together on Fridays on their own time at one of our gyms. And they'd come out and they would practice and play basketball. And uh, so over the years, um, it has evolved into, uh, we call it ho Hoops for a Cure. And we have a website set up where folks can go on, city employees and the public can go on and they can donate uh, for, toward breast cancer. And um, it's just a, it's a, a fun time for our employees and it's a, a good community event. And uh, we're, we're glad to be here. We're glad for the mayor's support and the commission's support. And we're gonna bring home the trophy this year.
on behalf of the city of Pompano Beach, thank you for coming out. Thank you for all the employees who showed up here, all the department heads. We really appreciate y'all's support. Um, unfortunately, uh, we weren't able to take the trophy home, so it's my honor and privilege and pleasure to present to Principal Johnson, first of all, this token here of the pictures that we did last year. I'm going to give them that. But then, it hurts me, but I got to do it. On behalf of the city of Pompano Beach, Principal Johnson, here is the trophy once again, my man. Students and staff at Grand City High School, we know that we have uh, John Mountain Village and y'all are getting older. Uh -oh. And they'll be over there next year, but we'll keep the trophy and keep it going, okay? <laughs> hey, how's it going? How's it going? Thanks, thanks for the refs. Thank you for the refs. Thanks everybody for coming out, really. Even those that switched on us, you know that? Uh, we'll see you next year, right? It's coming home to Pompano Beach next year. God bless. Everybody be safe.